Welcome to Hockey Valley, home of Penn State women's hockey. Today we're going to go on a tour of Pagula Ice Arena. Let's start downstairs and check out some of the team spaces. One of the first things you'll see when you walk through the doors headed into the locker room is this really cool display located right behind me. Penn State University is actually centrally located right here in the center of the state. That means easy access to cities like Pittsburgh on the west or even Philadelphia and New York City on the east. Also to the north, just a short trip to Ontario and Toronto. We're in the video study room, a state-of-the-art room that's open 24-7 to all student athletes. I'm here with Director of Hockey Operations, Chris Demchuk, who's going to show us around. Chris, tell me a little bit about some of your best and favorite features of the room. So the best feature in the room um, is our team video setup. So over here we have access to a couple different views on the ice during games and practice. Um, and this video will come straight down into these laptops um, where it's cut up and then players will have access on their iPads right after the game to watch their shifts, which makes it easy for them. Instead of having to watch the whole game, they can watch just when they're on the ice. Another feature of the room is the study area. Student athletes have access to 24-7, um, so if they want to pop in here in between classes or come in here and have a study session, this is open to them all the time. Welcome to the equipment room. It's all things gear related in here. Incoming freshmen can expect custom everything from gear to Nike apparel. Student athletes will have access to custom skate sharpening and contouring before every game. In addition to gear and apparel, there's also custom sticks. Each stick is tailored to every girl's individual needs. Here with Emily in the athletic training room. Emily, this room, obviously a lot of people might just think rehab only, but obviously it's not. Tell me a little bit about kind of what this room is for and what are some of its best features. When the girls do get injured, they can come in here and do all kinds of rehab and things like that. Uh, but we also have a lot of tools for when they're not injured and they just need to come in and recover. So we have the game readies, we have Normatex, we've got foam rollers, we've got the hydrotherapy room. We're the only training room on campus that has um, the underwater treadmill. When they're injured and they can't run or they can't skate, we can put them in there and they can get a really good workout. We've got the cold tubs, we've got a hot tub and a cold tub so when they come in after practice, they can go in there, get a nice recovery in. Uh, we've got a steam room, so that's really nice after the games or on Sunday when the girls want to come in, they can get in there. I'm here pretty much all day, every day, seven days a week when we're in season, so the girls don't have to go anywhere. They can come in early in the morning, late at night on Sundays, and they can come in and see me, and they can do whatever they want that they know is going to work with their body to make them feel better. How about an emergency situation? There's nothing worse than being far away from home. You wake up at night sick. What happens? They call me. Um, we have doctors that come in once or twice a week. They're here on game days so we can get them seen right away. We don't have to worry about it. We have an x-ray machine right here in the doctor's office so we don't even have to leave campus to get that taken care of and the doctors are, are also available 24-7. Behind me is a smart tech TV. Whether it's reviewing game film, practice film, it gives coaches an opportunity to teach good habits as well as go over moments where they've caught you being good. So in between the locker room and the door to get on the ice, we're in the stick room. Inside this room, there's absolutely no issues with space. Each area kind of has its own stick locker, and if you run up space out here, there's plenty of extra space down below. Here in the Penn State Hockey weight room, it's all about strength through range of motion and power. Take me through some of the best features inside this weight room. So I think we can create a powerful athlete by using all the different tools here. Each athlete can basically do their entire workout right there at that rack. Squat capabilities, bench press, power cleans, so that makes it super useful and super time efficient for these kids to come in here and, and get a really good workout done. Each athlete is going to have a tailored program to their specific weights because we want to play high tempo hockey. We want to make sure that every shift is 100% effort and in the CHA, the conference that we play in, uh, we'll be able to have the competitive advantage if we are able to repeat effort every single shift at our highest capability. I'm here with Kelsey Crow on the stick handling platform. Kelsey, tell me a little bit about how this all works and what goes on right here. Essentially what you can work on is toe drags, you can just do random uh, quickness exercises or range of motion. How about, what do we have going on over here? Uh, this is the rapid shot and this is where we practice shooting. Everyone gets a card, what you do is you swipe it in and then the first thing you can do is you can adjust your passing. Adjusting your passing, you can adjust how fast the puck comes out or you can adjust uh, how quickly in between each pass comes. And then what you can also do is you can select where you're getting the pucks from. So I'm a lefty, which means I would stand over there. And if I were to work on one-timers, I would want the puck only to come from my opposite side. So you can do that as well. I think it's extremely valuable. In my mind, if it takes you eight shots to score or four, like the reason you go from eight to four is in here. You only need four shots to score. <laughs> 